quick, easy install. Shouldn't be hard. See what's not cheap at all. Comes with some screws. You might be able to find a knockoff version of this, but way cheaper. I've seen them online. The only reason I bought this one was because I already have the windshield of that brand and I wanted to kind of keep it matching. Uh, it's Pug, I say pig. I don't know how it's pronounced, so don't kill me for it. But yeah, I ordered the pig wings and I got the pig windshield to match. This is what it looks like. It's a piece of plastic. It was over 200 bucks. Definitely not worth it. But for content purposes, I hadn't seen anybody done it yet. So I figured I'd order it, put it on. It should look okay. This is what it's gonna look like. like. A lot of manufacturers are putting wings on it. So I figured I'd throw a pair of wings on this thing. So we'll see how it looks. In the box, you get the wings and then you get some screws. Instructions, step one shows the disassemble of the four screws. Uh, step two shows the bracket being installed on there. It already came installed, the little grommet, screws and everything was already on there. Step three, this one, actually the number eight screw is gonna be the smaller one. It's gonna go here at the back end. And then for step four, it shows 10, 11 and nine, which is gonna be the longer screw, the little washer, and then this piece that's gonna go on top here in the front. So that should all come together. I think you can figure it out by looking at it. What threw me off was the bracket because I didn't know that it was already installed. So I was kind of looking for extra pieces, but it's already on the piece. The back part goes with the two Allen key screws. And then the front, you're going to have the Phillips screws that go here. Spacers, I thought initially they went in here where the grommet is. No, there's a second hole in the back. That's where you're going to put this little thing at because the pocket inside the screw to go all the way up will hold up in there it goes in the second hole not the first hole because if not this thing is going to look like this it's not going to be able to get flush so you'll move it to the second hole and then you'll get a flush mount because it hides up in there and look you end up with these two little covers one on this side already and it'll cover up that screw and actually the bracket was already mounted so i don't know why they didn't just throw that on but yeah it's for the side here and then i'll just put this other one here and I'll cover this screw up. That's what that's for. Wings are on, what do you guys think? I think it looks good. If it actually gave me some horsepower. Safety first, we gotta put the helmet on. If you guys are curious about what helmet this is, the EXOR1 by Scorpions, the carbon fiber one. Go check it out on their website if you have any interest. Listen to this M4 exhaust. This is the full M4 exhaust. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Overall, it changes the look of the bike. I think it looks cool. If you don't, you don't, that's fine. But I will link it down below if you have any interest on it. Let me know in the comments if you do like the wings or not, and if I should keep them or should I take them off. With that being said, I'll catch you guys on the next ride.